Well, some are already dubbing this as the winter that will never end. Meteorologist Scott Munt has a look at the snow depth. Kelloland just went through its second storm that dropped over a foot of snow in Sioux Falls. This comes after a week or two of melting. Now, during that time, the snow depth dropped to less than a foot in many locations. At the beginning of the month, we had 18 inches of snow on the ground. That fell to eight by the middle of the month, but after this recent snowstorm, we're easily back to 18 inches, and of course the drifts are much deeper. With March around the corner, I looked into the deepest snow in Sioux Falls history, and here's what I found for March and April. The deepest snow in March was 33 inches on the ground in 1969. After that, it falls to two feet in 1962 and 1951. April's deepest snow is 14 inches in 2018. That's the year Sioux Falls received over 30 inches of snow for that April. From there, it falls to 10 inches in 69 and 9 inches in 95, 94, and 1957. But time is on our side. Aside from tomorrow's bitter cold, any day with sunshine, snow will melt as the sun's angle continues to increase. Warmer temperatures return this weekend. In fact, it may warm enough to bring in rain on Monday, which in turn will also help accelerate the snow melt. After the storm, there is some beauty to be found, such as the sun dogs that appeared on the horizon during the morning hours. For Kelloland Weather, I'm meteorologist Scott Munt.